amazing job driving us. It's already two o'clock. It's okay though, we're gonna make it. And our batch are gonna be okay. Here's the bathroom, shower, and then here's the bed. Our view! Hey, Oliver, you want to say you miss me? Don't look up, remind me what we're looking for. Who's looking for me? Eliza, I'm looking for my own work. Work, 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 so so that work, 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 work. <laughs> Look at the outside, oh my gosh. We're on the sky. Oh, I have it on cinematic, hold on. We're on the skyline view. Sorry for my chapped lips. But we're on skyline view. We're gonna look at the view. It's locked. Aw, dang. Sorry guys, that was short lived. Oh, we have to do formal introductions. I've never done that before. Hey, <laughs> I'm Rachel. Follow me on Instagram, Soul Serenity. Follow me on TikTok, Soul Serenity. That's it. Have a great day. Yeah. I'm Zora. Instagram. Oh, that's it. TikTok. Oh, that's it. Hi. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> Dana. You already know who I am. My name's Silver. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, and that's it. And my chat works. Oh my god! Yeah. See you later. This hotel is insane. Y'all, look at this hotel. Oh, oh, what? 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 Oh. So I already put on my Palmer. I haven't started. And then I already did my but I'm going to scroll as soon as ahead of the game. For me, I have not started. And take not. my phone and record her pain. <laughs> hey, we're back. So sorry about the little. Already did oh, her sure. prep. This is my primer. It is the Urban Decay All Nighter Primer. What time is it? Sorry, y'all. I didn't realize it was this light. This is mix of Fenty <laughs> and Givenchy foundation. 385 and Fenty W something and Givenchy. I don't know. Yeah. This is milk concealer, all over concealer. And this is 20 zero or 20 O. And then this other one is a darker one and it's 24 M. This is Dana. Sorry. Now I feel like the people cool. on TikTok who are like, I'm running late. Get ready with me. Ziggy's dancing in the mirror. Zora's the first one ready. Let's the first one ready. I'm almost the first the first one ready. And that is on the record. Let the record reflect. Your hair is so cute. Thank you. I use this stuff Angela got me for Christmas. Shout out to our lone soldier that couldn't make it to this lovely getaway. 
This is Fenty Concealer. I this is soap and water. Ladies, don't be asking questions like, why y'all didn't do this, girl? I barely know what I'm doing right now. We are beginner. Very much so. Beginner, very much so. Yeah, like I literally just bought this stuff like 30 years ago. Yesterday. Oh, uh, this is L'Oreal blush. Okay. I just put it on my cheeks. You see how my lips look dry? We're just gonna put some chopstick before we put anything on it. Now it's time to add the blush. And I'm doing a lip liner, Marc Jacobs, Chestnut, the Black Girl Feel. I didn't even bring setting spray. Me neither, because it couldn't fit. Mm -hmm. See, when you do like frontier trips, you have, to, you have to freaking sacrifice a lot. So our next trip, we're actually going to pack mm -hmm. a real checked bag. We're going out of the country. Oh, <laughs> I love the yeah. enthusiasm. This is the butter gloss in Sherbert. Oh, and this is um, Rare Beauty yes, it blush. Is. And then this is Elf Monochromatic Stick in the color Bronze Cherry, and I'll put it on my eyelid. This is a Sephora Blending Eye Blush. So this is what my lips look like. We're just gonna go over it with the Dior Lip Gloss, and this is 001, and it's literally the shape thing. And this is the finished lip. So while Cindy finishes up, I'm just gonna brush my eyebrows up. Oh, don't get it caught in your hair like, oh no. Sydney. And this okay. is the e.l.f. one. I don't know, the logo rubbed off. And this then... is some um, perfume. I don't know what it's called. This is NYX Professor Professional <laughs> Makeup <laughs> Lip Pencil in Brown. Or is it? This is espresso. <laughs> this is mint lip oil from mm, the hair store. That sounds good. Hair store be best. Uh -huh. We're just gonna pluck out the bang a little because per we want to look fluffy. How are you on time? Oh, oh look, you were. Oh, right. you look cute, Sid Rich. And this is Billie Eilish Eilish perfume, and it's vanilla. That smells so good. Yeah, I love it. I love. One minute. You said one. Yeah. Okay. We're we're ready on time. This is lotion by Vaseline. <laughs> Steal it. Si, <Rachel>. señorita. <laughs> that was scary. I'm gonna leave everything in here because we gotta go. Bye. We're all ready. We're heading to dinner. Wait. Yummy, 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 yummy. One second. <laughs> we're heading oh, into dinner. 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 Yum. And we're late, so let's go. <laughs> okay, change of plans. We're at Hard Rock. I'll give a little story time when we're back in the room because what just happened was stupid. I forgot to record the food, but after that, after that, after that, I think you're not done. Okay, you're the real after that. What? <laughs> Hey guys, so we're back at the hotel room. We just got back from taking pictures in the lobbies. There's multiple lobbies, by the way. But tell me how, tell me how we were trying to go to this restaurant for dinner. It's called Views Bar and Grill. Detour. Hi hey girl, hi. Hey. Oh, this light is crazy. Oh. <laughs> It doesn't look that wanna be in it. Uh, like I was saying in the bathroom, the lighting's worse in here, but it's whatever. But tell me how we had a reservation at this place called Views Bar and Grill. And we were so excited. Yeah. Like the food looked good, the atmosphere looked good. I only heard good things on TikTok, good reviews. So I was like, okay, this is good. 
so we made a reservation for nine okay 9 p.m we get there 905 and we walk in and then i'm like oh there's a security guard that's weird i was like does this place like get crime that's normal for a lot of places in downtown city so i wasn't really like whatever and i got my bag searched and he <laughs> my bag searched and he took my id and then he looks at it all weird and he's like hmm, you can go in and i go in and then all of a sudden i turn around my friends aren't near me and my boobs are being felt up she right. goes, and touches my bag the security guard woman yeah the second security guard <laughs> so after i'm getting searched i basically felt like i was being felt up she was just like put your arms out and then i have hands in my boobs but whatever but um i turn around my friends are around me and they're like we're not 21 and i was like what do you mean that wasn't on the website and i'm like we're eating dinner let's go we're in let's go and then like there's a man and a woman the man let her in the first time he was yeah. very nice he was very professional very nice but the second security guard was a woman she was very rude to us as young adults and i think that's the only reason why we're like because mm. we get it she was doing her job 21 and up cool got it cool great but there was no need for her to be like y'all can't even wait inside for my friend sydney's at the freaking sydney's at the cons whatever and the thing that's blowing me is it's grinding oh, my gears whoa. because i'm the youngest out of all of us so why was i able to they get was in go, right and we're literally eating dinner we're not drinking smoking whatever, whatever. was going on dancing we were just going to we eat in the corner um, i, I already danced. saw the table we were supposed to go to it says sydney on it <laughs> no but she was pointing yeah. towards the table we we're supposed to go to and it was in the corner i was like we could eat and go so i went up to the front what's desk, it, the front desk for, yeah and i was like we're just gonna eat like it's not even that big of a deal like there wasn't anything on the website that said that it was no 21 plus no fine yeah print, and they're nothing. like but it's 21 plus after 8 p.m i'm like that's cool that's fine that's dandy but you have to tell people that especially if you you know we're reserved like exactly so we wasted our time our efforts our energy our hopes and our dreams period resituating one second but yeah i'm like that's all that's <laughs> fine like dandy but you didn't let us know and they're like the people at the front desk they're like we don't really care if you at all. sit here and then the lady the security she walks up and they're like she's not 21 and they're like we real know. mad and then they're like so i'm mad. sorry we have to cancel the reservation but we were actually about to sit down during black history month <laughs> but i just wanted to eat mm. like i told them i'm like we don't drink we're underage we showed you our real id if it was a fake i would have been like okay like, Snapping fake, it. we're yeah. doing too much yeah. showed our real ids we were honest and we didn't even know if there was an age restriction to be no we don't have fakes exactly oh, yeah. like i don't really study business but i took a business <laughs> class in middle school she's an influencer she is. But um, we're but in the midst of a story time at your TV videos. We still cute and I applause. Thank you. <laughs> and, oh, that's it. Yeah. But I took a business class in middle school, and what I learned is crazy. that uh -huh. is that whenever you inconvenience one of your customers or a potential customer, you all. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever you have a customer or potential customer, Sorry, okay. <laughs> like inconvenience, always right. you always like either give them a discount or just let them do what they were doing because you messed up. If yeah. that makes sense. Did, Did you show your phone? Yeah. But like, it's their fault that they didn't put the website on the clear. thing. And then you have a disrespectful security guard not understanding our situation and monster. just like shutting us down completely. So I'm like. I would have just gave us a discount or just let us sit down because we just wanted to eat. Mm -hmm. You was the only one with a problem. My mom and told me if you're the common denominator in the problem, you need to look inward. Thank mm -hmm. you. That's a word. <laughs> yeah. That's a word right there. All we could have done was eat. Like, nobody else cared but her. That's Literally. the part that's like, like, for them to be so strict on age restrictions, mm -hmm. like, it wasn't even like a club. People were just sitting at a bar. Like you can get that at freaking Dave Buster's. Game time in Tampa. Round one. Round one. Round one. Round one. <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese. Anywhere is what we're trying to say. <laughs> Why I could go in Rocco's Tacos and get me some tacos, but she won't let me sit here. Girl, I can I go in an actual club. Like mm -hmm. in the as long as I'm not drinking. drinking. Like chill. I get it. It's her job, even if it is 21. Yeah. 
she could have just redirected it completely different. Not, okay, go that way. Because we're getting like 10 different answers and then like... And then... Oh. Did you tell them when that man came? And she was friendly, friendly? Oh no, I Welcome didn't even see that part. Well, she wasn't there. we were standing outside in the cold, as I mentioned, breeze is breezing, wind is winding. Now what did we see, Rachel? Okay, honestly, this man, it wasn't even like he was, let me not even talk about him because he nope. ain't do nothing to him. I hope you have a God blessed day. Amen. He walks in, chill, ready for his ID to be checked. Her, oh my God, Andrew, blah, blah, blah. His name is not Andrew, I don't know his name, I don't care. Okay. <laughs> and then this lady comes behind Mr. Andrew, whatever okay. his name is. She goes to the lady, don't smoke in here. If I see you smoking, you're kicked out. Da -da -da -da. Okay, you can go in. But she Why is she vaping herself? Why is she vaping on this job? Hypocritical. And I just feel like you was not being a girl's girl. That's what they love to call it. I think we should people. all yeah. put our two cents in as our closing statement. I'm asking. This is my closing statement. I don't care that you kicked us out. I honestly don't. Mm -hmm. Just learn how to talk to people. That's my thing. I get your security, your job, whatever, restriction 21, blah, blah, blah. First of all, fix your fine print, because it ain't in the fine print. It ain't nowhere it's displayed. Nowhere. So I'm like, if that's the case, oh, oh okay. <laughs> if that's the case, speed it. Oh, <laughs> that's why they fall off. <laughs> and open. My closing statement is just learn to talk to people nicely. That's it. Kick us out if you need to, but talk nicely. Fix your phone line too, please. Yeah. I'm out. Thanks. Corporate yeah. My <laughs> closing statement is basically just be more organized when you're ho hosting a business. Like, because that business is popular too. Yeah. And I was excited. Like, the amount of, like, we social media presence they were getting, yeah. like, they, they had a lot of social media presence. And I was excited. The food looked good. The website looked good. And then, and then you want to tell me, oh, it's 21 plus after 8. Just be more organized. That's I my closing statement. I wasn't expecting a dub. She was like, are you asking for <laughs> I just found it odd. Like, I'm like, one, you were the only one with the problem, so you didn't even take a second to look inward and double check. Like, you weren't trying to even hear reason. But the thing about that is, that ain't got nothing to do with me. Take it up with God. And not even in a spiteful way, but God humbled you with anything like that. He humbled us. Okay, maybe we didn't even need to be in there for whatever reason, mm -hmm. for like, we don't know what could have came went down it yeah. could have got yeah. shot up students be crossed the street mm -hmm. but it's just what it is and i hope that the lord changes her heart um, fixes her heart posture thank you <laughs> what you get up? my closing statement would probably be learn to talk to people especially if you're working in a customer service based mm -hmm. industry yeah. Even though you're there for security, you're still dealing with other people. If you're gonna tell us we cannot be in an establishment, you could call me say, hey, um, I'm not sure if you guys are aware, after a certain time, this becomes like an 18, 19, 21 plus area. We can't have you in here, so I'm gonna have to kindly ask you guys to leave. Mm -hmm. Instead of saying, you're not 21, get out. There's better ways to go about it. Especially since I made a reservation and my car yeah, was attached to the reservation. Your, your car, car was attached? Yeah, so I'm like, if oh, I was girl. charged for something, that's going to make me even more mad. Yeah. Because I'm like, the way that the other security guy, <laughs> the secu I know I did my closing statement, but like the way the other security guard like let me in, it made me seem like other people our age were in we're there. In because word. she just showed up and then she had a problem. Mm -hmm. But like, yeah, that whole thing was annoying. <laughs> but we had good dinner at Hard Rock. I need to take this makeup off. And we gotta take our showers and get up in the morning to go to World of Hope. But yeah, guys, stay tuned. I know this video might be long, or maybe it's not. I don't know. We'll Editing Sydney yeah. will let uh. you know. Say good night, everyone. Good night. I just want to make a little disclaimer um, for the restaurant. The restaurant looked really nice. We're mainly just ranting because we're just upset that we got turned away and we're just heated in the moment. But the restaurant looked really nice. We only heard good things. It was just our experience. And yeah, nothing against the restaurant. The restaurant's fine. Get unready with us.
<laughs> this is how the makeup held up tonight. My eyebrows just need to be done. It's not even a makeup thing. It's my Cellar Skin Breathe Cleansing Wipes for your face and okay. eyes. We're doing so this it's with just my Cellar Water. Okay. And I got it from Five Below. That's two bucks. Okay. Wow, guys, this is so fun. It smells good. Guys, look at that. Yeah, I literally did a baby swipe. Well, yeah. let me do the power of makeup. Only do one half. Okay. But I feel like we also don't put on makeup. Yeah, because I'm like, there's hardly a difference. Okay. <laughs> I don't use wipes. I be using like, like. Either coconut oil or, or rub. Coconut oil is better. I need to start doing that too. Yeah, I use coconut oil, then I just wash my face. This or is not good for the environment. I'm sorry. Okay, so this is what I look like without makeup. <gasps> don't be scared. It's <laughs> me. It's <laughs> me. I don't think I look that different. I don't think you look that different. Yeah. We don't use these a lot. Okay, let me moisturize. Okay, I'm following your lead. Do we need to wash our face now? Okay. No, 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 we're gonna wash our face. I, like, never wash my face. And I feel like my skin is kind of fine. Is that bad? I don't know. My skin is acne prone, so I'm going to wash my face. Mm -hmm. Body wash. I usually use body wash. For your face? I swear, I don't And really... that's so crazy to me because your skin is, like, very nice. I feel like if you have drier skin, then it's, like, oh. you have to be less. I'm so yeah. stupid. Because my, my skin is, is dry. really dry. Mine is, like, acne prone. <laughs> the way Cindy's beating up her face is crazy. I've never seen this before. I lost my face, guys. It's not getting any wrinkles. What? Punching your face? I'm doing this. Punch him. This is Palmer's face. Well, I need more. My hand? This is good molecules. This coloration serum. Mario oh, Badescu. Oh. I just got a new one. This is just a travel sauce. Yeah. 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 What is ever dry? Yeah. And that's all I do. Okay. Oh. It's yes. Now I'm just gonna put some chapstick on. Okay, and now we're taking off our jewelry. This is gonna look okay. really serious. You're about to see us in our natural form. Natural state. Ring gone. <gasps> Whoa. I have my little jewelry book. I didn't bring mine. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. <laughs> and we're done. No. Bye bye. Good morning. Bye -bye. Excuse how I look, but it's the next day. I got myself some tea. It is 32 degrees outside. Feels like 26. Good morning, good morning, good morning. <laughs> Heading to the Chick fil A for breakfast. We got ready. Sorry, I didn't record. It was a time crunch. On our way to World of Coke, it's really cold. And we're right on time. We didn't get Chick-fil-A though. Guys, it's 17 degrees outside. It's 32, <laughs> it's still cold. But yeah, we're on our way to World of Coke. We got breakfast at CVS. They had a peanut butter chocolate granola bar. Yeah. See you later. You already know.
Detroit, Panama, Santa Fresca, Fresa. Cheers! Like a yeah, like the next the Viva from Moldova. I'm just gonna do a little bit this time. Next, Fanta China sour plum flavor. Oh my gosh, this is so interesting. Why does it smell like barbecue sauce? Because it is. <laughs> yeah, that is definitely sour plum, y'all. It's not bad. It's an acquired taste, and I'm not used to that. Okay, the next one is Jamaica Nada, and it's from Mexico. Pretty good. Next one, Germany. This is Banacqua, and it's apple. Hello? Apple. Bur 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 apple. Pear. Apple. Apple pear. Apple pear. Every single one other. I like this one. It tastes like a pear. This is North America. Barlitos, Agua Frescas, Mango Lime. Oh, I like that. Delicious, delectable. This tastes like a plum. The next one is from North America as well, and it's Vitamin Water Zero Squeezed Lemonade. We already know what that tastes like. Mmm, delectable. I like this one. We won't pour it out though, because we got a lot of other flavors to try. Next is from Malawi, Malawi, and it's called Mazo Blackberry. Ooh, Next is Zimbabwe. It's called Sparletta and it's Sparberry soft drink. I like Sparletta. That was good. It tastes like Panda. Mm -hmm. Next is Minute Maid Joy from Korea and it's Apple Lychee. Oh, yeah. Ooh, this is really good. The next one, while she's finishing up, is from Honduras, and it's Delaware Punch. Delaware? Cheeks. <laughs> it's given like ocean spray, or if you know, I need to find the picture, but I'll put it in. But there's this like, a Japanese candy that tastes like grape, and it like fizzes in your mouth. It's good though. It's really light. Let me make this horizontal, because now my format's gonna be messed up. Perfect. Next one is North America Gold Peak Sweet Iced Tea. I know I like this one. <laughs> I like this one, yeah. Delicious, delectable. Yeah, Peru Inca Cola. I like it. Mmm. Mm. It's strong though. It is. <laughs> All my videos are just cinematic. So that's okay. Her. And then the next one, while she's finishing up and recording, is Thailand Phantom Mel Melon Frost. I actually tried this one before. It's really good. I just like brought back memories. This one is Tanzania and it's Stony Ginger Beer. How do you say it? Tanzania. Isn't it Tanzania? Tanzania. I knew that. This is Tanzania Stony Ginger Beer. <laughs> that is ginger beer. Sure is. If this don't clear out my sinuses, I don't know what will. <laughs> the next one is from Italia and it's Beverly. Cheers. Cheers. That's Beverly. Sure is. It's just very strong grapefruit taste. Mm -hmm. I was not prepared. Okay, next one. Alrighty. Now this is unsweetened gold peak from North America. Italy was ridiculous. Yeah. Well, from um, Italy was horrible. And that what? Is, that's definitely unsweetened. The next one is Spain Aquarius Libre. Love it. Cheers. Like lemon water. <laughs> the next one is North America Powerade Mountain Berry Blast. But we have that like every day. Philippines Royal. Watermelon. She was just trying. I like this. Delectable. One. That's a strong flavor. Like it was just a lot of acid. <laughs> the next one is from Germany and it's called the Mezzo Mix. And there's some other stuff in German, but I don't know what it says. It's like a Coca Cola. The next one is from Madagascar and it's called Bonbon Anglais. Oh, this one's sweet. 
I can't put my finger on it, but I know this from somewhere. Yeah, it tastes really good though. And then the next one is from Thailand. It's Fanta Apple Cookie. Really good. That's really good. Okay, Thailand, Philippines, and Madagascar are carrying. Oh my god. The next one is from Brazil. It's called Quat. Quat! It tastes good though. Next station. Bye bye. We got cheese from Georgia. We'll just edit that out. You guys didn't see that. <laughs> Delicious, get it all the time in the dining hall. Literally. Next. I hope it works this time. <laughs> Alright, so Uganda. It's Uganda. exotic. Exotic Fanta. Cheers. That's good. I like it. Like <laughs> <laughs> Next one is North America High C. You get that all the time. I'm gonna skip it. Yeah, next one, North America, Fruit Punch from Minute Maid. Literally had that this morning, basically. I want to try the cream. Yeah. I never had red cream soda from Barks, but I've had their root beer and cream soda. Barks? Why do mm -hmm. I think it was something else? Maybe it's not. But this is from North America. Okay, so it's their cream soda red. Because I have their had their cream soda before. Good, I like it. The next one is called Enjoy Tab and it's from North America. I've never seen this one. Me neither. It must be in Canada. Hmm. It's like absolutely. Thank you very much. Next one, Sprite from Romania. I wonder if it tastes different though. Probably. Sprite. It tastes different. It has like a crisp. Cool yeah. Now the last one at the station is Aha. the Aha Sparkling Water Lime and Watermelon from North America. I didn't know that Aha was North, um, from Coke. Sorry. I knew I was gonna like it. Aha. One more station to go. So this is the last one. There's High C Pop and Lemonade. We get it all the time. Wow. Pop and Lemonade. Delicious. The next one is North American vitamin water and no. the flavor acai blueberry pomegranate. We get, get that at school time. in the vending machine. Mm -hmm. Next one, BBC Venezuela fused tea de negro. Oh no. <laughs> she thinks she's so funny. She's like this very much. We get that all the time. Next one is from India and it's called Thumbs Up. Cheers. It's Coca Cola with a twist. I think she was just looking at the flavors. Oh, okay. Dominican Republic and it's called oh, Country Club. Cheers. I like it. It's like cream soda. The next one is from Greece and it's Fanta Pineapple. So it good. A next one is from Chile and it's called Manzana Left Roja. Good to water. Last and final one, guys. Oh my gosh. My stomach. Yeah, there's so much soda in a little time. This one is from Costa Rica and it's called Fanta and it's Camita flavored. Have you ever had a chubby drink? This like, this like, it tastes like medicine, but like not in a way that I hate it. That's it guys, we'll see you at the exhibits.
him and we're finished i have to record something for a club i'm in so people are watching me she's doing great in the comments be like go sid down below and she's doing great that's why they're watching because she's so good this is pretty <laughs> So hey guys, I just finished recording for my audition and, and she did good. She did great. Everybody was staring at me and judging me so and judging good. me. No, they were not judging. Bye. How's it going, man? I just wanted to check in with you and see how things are going on your side. Uh, yeah, I really think I'm going to marry this girl. Uh, seems like it's for real this time. Here's the view, so pretty. We were just over there. Okay, so this is the aftermath. Yeah. Yummy. Yeah. Dessert. <laughs> it's falling. Huh? Mm. I want more. <laughs> Mm. Really good. We're at the museum. I'm watching you sit there with my best friend. Okay, you're a good art tour guide? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Come with me. Yeah. Yes. Yes, meow. <laughs> mm -hmm. Wow, it's spinning. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something that features. You'll find the beauty goes much deeper once you get to me. Life is so fun, guys. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Stop. Do you think that I would be the man that's perfect, perfect for you? Over and over, contemplating my thoughts when I was sitting here sober. I'm gonna start up. Pretty refreshing. And I gotta take a Hey guys, so we just got back to the room and we met so many nice people. <laughs> yeah. We met so many nice people. I'll show you the view. Wow. We're back on foot. It's about like two and a half hours later. We took a nap. Me and Zora changed. Yeah, I took a nap. And Diana took a nap. 
because I was tired. But yeah, now we're going to Metro Diner. So I'll show you when we get there. It's supposed to be super cute, so we'll find out. Hey guys. In public, in a public area. But that's okay. I'm just very emotional. Yeah. I'm in touch with my emotions and I'm just really thankful for everything. Don't start. Oh my god. That's all. I just want to update you. I'll show you our food when I get some. Sorry, I already dug in, but. I'm not enough. Food very delicious. So we're walking back to the hotel. I don't know if you saw, I don't know if I put it in the vlog, but we made a music video. Back in the room. I think we're all tired a little bit. We're gonna wind down, eat some dessert or something, and then pack my bag. <laughs> good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. So, we're about to go to brunch, and my dad's picking us up in like 20 minutes. See you later. About to head to breakfast. Bye, hotel. We're here, we're at brunch. It's right there. <laughs> Shout out to Sydney's dad. Best driver in the world. Yeah. That's my best. Oh. My mom too. And my dog. <laughs> Hopefully they let us in. There's a dress code, but. There's a dress code? Yes. Come on. Hey, Sydney. Hey, Sydney. Hey, Sydney. So, I just finished eating or made a dent in a way. It was really good, actually. She got the same thing. Um, yeah, I believe the chicken was tossed and uh, yeah. breaded very nicely. Just seemed like buttermilk. Yeah, buttermilk. Yes, yeah, really good, really good. Yeah, we're food critics. Yeah. It was honestly delightful. You know, it was real authentic chicken. They got it from the back. The bone in it. Hello. Oh, uh, the bone in it. Hi. Hi. Nice, great steak. It was good. Period. Uh, it was different. <laughs> it was good. I like the vibe. Great restaurant. De definitely upscale dining. We have to try for dinner, and I think instead, because we're picky about our breakfast. But yeah, that's our review. If you want to try this food, go to Five Church in Midtown or Buckhead. <laughs> My baby girl. <laughs> Bye to my dad! But we're at the airport. And we're going back to Boca. Oh my god. Sorry, I was just making a TikTok. <laughs> we're on our way to the train to go to our terminal. We already went through security. We made we made it to Terminal D. 
We have an hour to search around, so you can come with us. We should go busking. <laughs> I'll update you in a second. We need to find where we're going. It's dark in here, but we made it. And we paid $100 for our bags because they were being dumb. What a great end to our trip. Yep. Mm -hmm. And I was trying to explain it to the lady, but she was not having it. She was like, well, you should have just checked your bag over a bag that could fit under the seat. Because everyone that they stopped, we were all like, we flew here with the same bag and it was mm -hmm. no problem. Yeah. So why is it an issue? Yeah. And I literally sat down and guess what? My bag fit under the seat. Even That's what I was like, I'm just going to pay it because he wants me to pay it. He's like, either you pay it or you miss the flight. TSA was so lovely. Yeah, our mm -hmm. TSA people were pretty good. And usually it's the complete opposite. opposite. But how would you guys rate the trip? Four out of ten. To, sorry. Just Do the, the trip day. and then the okay. the airline. I already know what I'm going to rate the airline, but the trip I know. Oh, I'm gonna rate. trip solid. Eight out of ten. A nine out of ten. There's mm -hmm. room for improvement. So mm -hmm. Nine out of ten. It was great though. And then how would you rate Frontier? Zero. They're like a five out of ten. Mm -hmm. Trip. Eight out of ten. Mm -hmm. It would have been great if. It wasn't so cold. Mm -hmm. Frontier, you get a one. I would rate you a zero, but you get a one. <laughs> it's giving Tyra. <laughs> like literally, like the first, the on the way here, great. The people on the way back ruin your whole rating. Y'all need to talk to them. The trip, I rate it seven. One point for cold. One point for the lounge. One point for the, the views. Sky. Okay, that's that's understandable. A, a rating is like, did you have fun or not? Yes mm -hmm. no. Yeah, so I had fun. Yeah, but, perfect. Um, airlines negative three thousand. I definitely agree. Negative TSA maybe a plus. Yeah, all these TSA. different scales. TSA was a ten out of ten. And it's usually Frontier not like that, which is crazy. Was a negative three. Yeah. Absolutely not. And I was saying on the plane, I'll say it again. Even if you're if you're gonna have people pay for these bags, there's a way to go about it with proper customer service, and I'm mm -hmm. severely lacking. So I rate the trip a nine out of ten. I had a lot of fun. Um, if I wasn't feeling under the weather, it would be mm -hmm. better. And then I give Frontier a three out of ten simply for making it alive, getting a seat. And no, I gave it a two out of ten just for making it alive and Hello? getting a seat. Yeah, because that's the bare minimum of a flight, to be honest. But yeah, that was our experience. I had a lot of fun um, at in Atlanta and on the way to Atlanta. Coming back was sadly not the same. Okay, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and more of the story. Just participate in good customer service. It is not hard and it's the bare minimum. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Whoa. Took the wrong later. Love you. Be safe. Next stop, Chicago. In three quarters of a mile. Next stop, Chicago. Don't mark me on that, but maybe. I don't know. Hi, toodles. Give me the green light. It works. Radical. Wow. So fun. Boca. Bye. Thanks for watching.